Football on the Sports Max Zone continuing to make the headlines or take the spotlight. Jamaica's senior men's football team captain, Andre Blake, will be returning to his hometown in Clarendon this weekend to host an eight-a-side football competition called Family Soccer Sunday in a partnership with Nevada Soccer Academy. The competition will be geared toward giving back to Blake's community and will see children from all ages being included in the festivities. Give, giveaways, there will be football competitions. Andre Blake now joins us live via Zoom to talk about this. Uh, Andre, let me start first of all by congratulating you on being MLS goalkeeper of the year for the, for the third time, although your Philadelphia Union team just fell short of the title. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Um, definitely was great winning that award, but would have even been better if we could have gone all the way. But it's football. It happens. Yeah, well, well they'll, they'll be next year, won't they? Um, let's start with your Clarendon project. Um, let, first of all, where exactly in Clarendon is this, um, this festivity on, on the weekend? So we'll be at the Versailles football feel and and that's in maple and clarendon pretty much right off trenton road so very very easy to to find so that's where we'll be on sunday yeah um talk to us about the involvement or the partnership with the nevada soccer academy and how how did you incorporate that into this project yes yeah, so the ceo for for nevada is omar daly who is also a past reggae boy so um, he's also from Clarendon. So when I initially thought about doing this, you know, one of the first things that came to mind was um, I want to have the youths involved. And I really admire what he is doing, coming back and, and helping out the, the parish and the community. So I thought what would be better than to really partner with him because what he's doing and what I want to do in, in the future kind of align. So I thought it would be really important for, for us to, to start doing these little things together. Yeah, so how is everything set for this project on, on Sunday and how excited is the community about it? I am very excited. The, the community is very excited. I've been getting really good feedbacks. Actually, we have 21 teams registered so far. I've never wow. seen this in a, in a, in a competition for a, <laughs> for a single day. So I'm looking forward to it. Um, something that I've always wanted to do and um, I've been getting really good feedback, good support. So we're just looking forward to an enjoyable Sunday afternoon where we can come out and be entertained or, 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 or um, as well as be the one that's entertaining others. So, yeah. Yeah. But you've had similar projects before. This one sounds a lot more hyped up and so on. And uh, from a participatory standpoint, maybe the biggest. But this isn't the first uh, project of this kind that you've had, is it? No, I've had a kid's treat before. Yes, I remember that. Yeah, and now this one is more of a, a family where we have, I really put more into this one. It was more carefully planned and it's something that I'm looking to, to really make into an annual thing. So hopefully, you know, this is the, the beginning of something great and, and something that we're looking to, to, to evolve and to get better at each year. Yeah, Andre Black, Blake, I want to point out too that your, your parish is a, is a big parish in, in, in Jamaica when it comes to football. We noted that in the schoolboy finals uh, last week, well, both of the Costa Cup final and the Ben Francis Cup final were contested by Clarendon teams. So <laughs> that, that was a, a pretty significant happening there. And um, Glen Muir and Clarendon College, your former school is it. Um, emerging champions, so Clarendon appears to be in a good space when it comes to football from a parish level. Yeah, definitely. We, we really have some good talents here. I am from Clarendon, um, obviously. We have Rudolph Austin, we have Javon Watson, we have Omar Daly, we can go back as far as Christopher Dawes. So we really had some, some good talents coming through Clarendon, and, and for me, I feel like one of my, my aim, one of my goal is to continue to to give back and to help out and to also be able to identify these talents and to, to really be there for them to kind of help them to make this transition and to see me live, see me in person and, and, and to know that, all right, be inspired. I did it and, and so can you. All right, Andre, we're going to leave it there. All the best for Sunday. You said you have 21 teams registered so far, which suggests that there, there may be other teams coming in. I hope the organizers can, you know, get everything together. And we hope you have a wonderful day on Sunday. And, and good work, man. We, we like to see, you know, players giving back in the way that you are.
All right, thank you. Thanks much for having me. Yeah, man, Andre Blake there, national goalkeeper, plays for the Philadelphia Union in the MLS. And uh, we go to break now. We have a lot more to come on the Sportsmax Zone.